Pomeranians are tiny, alert, and intelligent dogs who are popular among many households. According to the American Kennel Club, this breed ranks 24th as the most popular dog breed of 2021. While they are loved by many people, there are several reasons why this breed might not be for you. And we'll talk about all of that in this video. In general, Pomeranians stand between 6 to 7 inches, with weight ranging from 3 to 7 pounds. Historically, this breed is a favorite among commoners and royals because they're happy dogs who provide excellent companionship to their family. Because they're alert, they also make great watchdogs who will let you know if something suspicious is going on. With all that being said, what could be the reasons why this breed might not be for you? Tune in to find out. Hey there, and welcome to Smart Dog Lover. New to our channel? Feel free to hit the subscribe button if you want to hear dog-related stuff every day. As mentioned earlier, for today's video, we'll talk about the 10 reasons why you should not get a Pomeranian. So, without further ado, let's start. Number 1. Do not get a Pomeranian if you live close to your neighbors. Pomeranians are great watchdogs, and they'll surely let you know if someone's approaching your home or if the doorbell rang through their loud barks. Not only that, but these dogs also like to use their voice to communicate with their family. Hungry? Needing attention? Asking you to take them out for walk? They'll definitely let you know about it. For this reason, Pomeranians are not suitable if you live close to your neighbors, if you have thin walls, and if you live in a home with noise restrictions. Fortunately, you can train them to be quieter using the right techniques. Number 2. Do not get a Pomeranian if you won't allow them to live inside the house. There are dogs who prefer patrolling the vicinity of your home, and there are also dogs who thrive when they stay close to their family. Pomeranians fall to the latter category. These dogs are the perfect size to prey on wild predators at night, so it's important to ensure that they stay indoors. We also mentioned how these dogs tend to bark. Just imagine how much they would bark if they're outside and can see everything that's going on near your home. Most, especially Pomeranians, should be kept indoors because because they're the happiest when they stay close to their family. If you leave them outside of the yard or at the kennel, they may feel lonely, unloved, and unwanted, which could lead to development of destructive behaviors. Thankfully, their small size doesn't require you to live in a spacious home. Number 3. Do not get a Pomeranian if you do not have enough time to groom them. Pomeranians have beautiful coats, but it does come with a price. To avoid mats and tangles, you need to brush them every day. They do shed, but they'll shed more heavily at certain periods of the year. During these times, you will need to brush them more often to help minimize the fur that they shed. If you want to make their fur more manageable, you can also bring them to a professional groomer for occasional trimming. Despite their luxurious coats, these dogs wouldn't mind playing in puddles or getting dirty if they're given the opportunity to do so. Fortunately, their coats are easy to clean. Bathing should only be done every now and then or when they really need it. Number 4. Do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot provide them with their own space. Pomeranians have an independent tree and you must respect their behavior if you decide to bring them to your home. These dogs may also have their own routine and sometimes they'll choose to be alone. This means that you should provide your dog with their own space, such as on the corner or somewhere quiet. This will enable them to relax when they feel like being alone or when the environment is too noisy that they need a place to calm themselves. Don't worry though, after a while, they'll go back to being that happy, loving dog. Number 5. Do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot establish yourself as the Alpha. Despite their size, Pomeranians like to be the Alpha dog. This means that if they don't see you as a strong leader, they will not hesitate to take the role of being the boss around the house. This can be a problem, especially if you already have dogs in the house that are much larger than them. Once those dogs get fed up with your palm's behavior, they may get into trouble. With that said, Pomeranians need a strong and firm leader who knows how to handle them properly. As soon as you take them home, let them know that you're the leader of the pack in order for them to respect you and your commands. Just keep in mind that being a strong leader does not mean that you need to be harsh with your dog. Never shout, hit, or punish your dog in any way that will lower their self-esteem. 
as it will only lead to a dog that is neither aggressive nor shy. Instead, you should use the right techniques when training your dog, such as giving them treats, praises, and playtimes as the form of reward for good behavior. And we're now halfway through this video. So far, what do you think about Pomeranians? Do you think that they're the ideal dog for your home? Let us know your comments later on, because for now, we have a few more things to talk about these marvelous dogs. So let's continue. Number six, do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot provide them with early socialization. Pomeranians are small dogs, which is why socialization is very important to keep them away from situations where they are challenged by other dogs. Remember, Pomeranians like to be the alpha dog, which means they can be dominant with others. This can cause serious injuries, especially if they're confronted by a large dog. Therefore, while still young, expose your dog to different sights, sounds, environments, people, and animals to help control their dominant behavior. You also need to be proactive and always watch your surroundings whenever you take them out in public, because even if you have a well-trained socialized palm, you don't know if other dogs will stay in their place and not challenge your dog. Number seven, do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot handle their temperament. Pomeranians are not your average small dog. Descended from sled dogs such as Huskies, Akita, and Alaskan Malamutes, Poms are not the type of dogs that will stay on your lap all day, every day. Instead, these dogs are more likely to chase after critters, insects, dig the ground, and they wouldn't mind getting dirty by rolling on muds and puddles. Thanks to their heritage, Pomeranians are also energetic for their size. Therefore, you will need to spend time exercising regularly. Because they're intelligent, you also need to provide them with toys, such as food puzzles and chew toys, to keep themselves busy. Without sufficient mental and physical stimulation, they can become bored, which could lead to development of destructive behaviors. Number 8. Do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot provide them with regular veterinary checkups. Although they're considered as healthy dogs, Pomeranians may suffer from certain health conditions that you need to look out for. If you're considering this breed, some of these include luxating patellas, hip and elbow dysplasia, eye problems such as cataracts and ectropion, and ear problems. Therefore, to ensure that your dog lives a healthy, happy, and long life, make sure that he gets to visit the veterinarian once or twice a year. On average, Pomeranians can live for 12 to 16 years, provided that they are raised properly. Number nine, do not get a Pomeranian if you will easily give in to their requests. Pomeranians are intelligent dogs and combine this with their strong determination, this breed will try to outsmart you if given the opportunity. Somehow, these dogs know humans' weaknesses and will try to use them to get what they want. For example, if you're eating, these dogs will adorably look at you with their puppy eyes or they will also circle around you and give you adorable stunts in the hope that you will give them a share of your food. If you give in, then expect them to be your table side companion for life. Therefore, it's important to train them properly and give them their needs so that they won't be problematic once they grow old. Number 10. Do not get a Pomeranian if you cannot potty train them. Like most small dogs, Pomeranians tend to be harder to house train compared to large dog breeds. For this reason, you must have extra patience and effort, especially when it comes to potty training. These dogs are small, which means that they may relieve themselves in an area where you cannot easily reach, such as under the table or under the couch. Therefore, if you don't want your home to smell like a doggy bathroom, train your dog how to potty. For example, always observe your dog. When you see signs that they need to go potty, take them to the designated area and then give them treats after a successful attempt. For the right family, Pomeranians are loving, obedient, and entertaining dogs who will bring smiles and laughter to everyone in the family. Of course, like all dogs, they're not for everyone. Therefore, it is very important to assess yourself if you think you can handle these dogs so that they don't end up in the shelter. With efforts and patience, Pomeranians will be amazing companions that will never make you feel alone. And that wraps up our video today. What do you think about Pomeranians? Do you think they're the right dog for your home? Comment down your thoughts below. As always, if you enjoy today's content, 
make sure to like, share, and subscribe. To be notified when we upload new videos, make sure to click the notification bell button. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video.